Nadine Doris is back. Well, technically, she never went away. She's been on the right-wing Tory propaganda channel, GB News, that isn't a news channel, apparently. But we haven't seen her on the mainstream news channels for some time. Well, since she stepped down as Secretary of State for the Digital Media, Culture and Sport. But at the weekend, she took part in a very strange interview with Laura Kunzberg, where you have to ask yourself, is it really just an act, or is she as thick as she comes across? I couldn't believe the words that came out of her mouth. And then what followed was, after some very bad editing, a conversation about Boris Johnson where she completely just contradicts what she just said like 30 seconds ago. Have a watch and tell me what you think of this bizarre exchange. Do you think, I mean, you're having a go at TV presenting these days. I'm a TV presenter. Do you think that presenters, somebody as big and as well known as Philip Schofield, actually just have too much power in the industry? So there's this thing, isn't there? There are men, it's men particularly, who have positions of authority or trust and power, kind of think they're above the law and above those standards that the rest of us are held by and held to. And I think there is absolutely an element of that which takes place. You talk there about men in power, uh, Nadine Dorries, obviously with a very different set of circumstances. Um, there's been rather a lot of rumpus about your old friend Boris Johnson and some of his behaviour when he was still in power. Um, complaints about what happened during the lockdown have been referred again to police this week. And his allies, they were claiming it's some sort of stitch up. Isn't the suggestion that it's stitch up just spin and nonsense? Oh, come on, Laura. It's um, anybody who thinks that just weeks before the Privileges Committee were about to announce um, their findings into the inquiry, um, that this just happened to, to just happen to be discovered and found and reported, I'm afraid, is it's for the birds. It's quite something to say, aha, it must have happened. It's quite something else to actually have evidence of that and make claims that the government has been acting inappropriately. The only people who are acting inappropriately and making false claims are those who have sent these diaries off to the police and off to the Privileges Committee just a few weeks before the Privileges Committee was about to report on its findings. Just lastly, there is also a rumpus about the number of people that Boris Johnson wants to send to the House of Lords. Are you still expecting to get a peerage? So I've never officially been told that is happening. Everybody else... Not is officially. Happening. No, but the only thing I've seen is a leak to a newspaper, so I don't expect anything in this life, Laura. I'll just take whatever comes my way. Mad Nads is no stranger to odd interviews, and you can see her best ones in the video that's on screen now. Don't forget to hit the like button or the join button for memberships. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>